Welcome. If you're just tuning in, oh my goodness, where have you been? I always say where have you been because we've done a lot. But don't worry, you can always you know watch this again you know, on our YouTube channel. Regardless, I have with me an amazing artist who, as I said before, you know, from he transitioned from being an artist to a producer. See, his name is like where you're about to speak in tongues. So it is Chabalayaga. Chabalayaga. So he's a music producer and he began his journey in 2016 after, you know, realizing that studio cost is very expensive. So that motivated him to become a producer. I know, and his first major success came in when he signed an artist. You know, you looked forward to someone who would make him, you know, very known. Um, you know, this has even made him to collaborate with so many great artists as well. He won an award, you know, as the best music producer of the year in Flabbergasted Award in 2018. He has a degree in mechanical engineering and also music technology, in mechanical engineering in Yaba Tech. And also he studied music technology in um, Petty yeah. Film Institute. Yeah. I have with me no other person but Shabala Yaga. How are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome I'm to the show. Fine. Thank you very much. Uh, first of all, let me just say, right? Why that name? You got it. It's not too long. No, it's not too long. Chabala Yaga. Say that Chabala Yaga. Chabala Yaga. Three times. Chabala Yaga, Chabala Yaga, Chabala Yaga. <laughs> All right. Chabala Yaga, Chabala Yaga, Chabala Yaga. There's a Y. Okay. I <laughs> Very with me, but welcome to the studio. Thank How you. are you doing? I'm very fine. How okay, first you? of all, you're an artist. Yeah. And you already said from the introduction, you know, you are just tired of, you know, when it comes to studio sections and you said, you know, going to becoming a producer. So, mm -hmm. what motivated you to just switch from becoming an artist to a producer? Well, um, talking about studio sessions, money, mm. Mm, the cost is. Um, that's for good productions. Okay. The cost is a, is a lot. And you know, there's some times where I have a freestyles or I have a vibe, and because of money, I won't be able to mm. record. Sometimes in the midnight, there's a vibe. Yes. But you know, it has been so easy since I became my own music producer. I make beats for myself, you know. It has given me enough space to do my thing. Mm -hmm. So now let's talk about your first break. You okay. know. So talk about the artists that just made you, you know, come that we're not knowing now. We're talking about mm -hmm. Kudus, Kudus you know. So what was it him that you just say that, okay, you know this, I want this person to be working with me as my artist. And, you know, how did that experience shape your career? Well, um, let me start by uh, appreciating <laughs> the platform. Okay. You understand? And uh, since then, since after the winning, I've had a lot of collaborations. Yes. Where people want to link up with me. Like, because the competition was actually for, um, can I mention names? Yes, please. Okay, Badiosha and um, Naira Mali yes. were the ones that created 44 minus 4. So that was the name of the competition. Then Kudos Ali Jono came to my studio, just did like a freestyle and became big. And man, since then, it has been. Voila. Mm. <laughs> so what, what, what will you say, you know, you talk about collaborations, right? Yes. So what will you say, you know, what do you look for in an artist before working with this kind of person? Oh. Their, their, their charisma, their, their ability to be able to link up, share ideas. Because as a, as a music producer, when, when you're in your music space, Everybody that is around you is supposed to have that same aura with you. So uh, I'm looking forward, you know, greater times. Okay. I always enjoy my session with all of my artists. Oh, I always enjoy the session. I swear. Even though it's not going well, I like, yeah. make sure as a music producer. Yeah, just you always have to have the vibe. Yes, the vibe okay. has to be there. Okay, I know there's always vibe, right? Yeah. You know, being a producer. Yeah. Um, but let's talk about some of the challenges. You know, we're in this country, we're in this. Nigeria as a whole is a challenge. So you as a music producer, what, what would you say are some of the challenges you face, you know, as a producer? Um, <laughs> I, oh, you know the first challenge. And the first <laughs> challenge, you challenge you. Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, 
you know, for uh, a music producer that is uh, trying to, you know, create a niche in the industry, create a name for himself, you know, it's, it's a whole lot of hard work. Yeah. Networking, meeting up with people. Okay, this is what I do. Just two seconds, I met a guy in the bedroom telling him I'm a music producer. All right. I just advertised myself. Okay, okay. So, yeah. so you just <laughs> have you know, to yeah, just have put to yourself put out there. Myself out there. Yeah. Very good. No, networking is very, very important. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, you're a, a man of different, you know, talent. Why I say that? Because apart from being an artist, then I become, became a producer. Mm. Mechanical engineering. Okay. If not because of my mic, I will have to ballet for you. <laughs> well done. And also, you know, getting music technology. Thank you. you know? So those are two big degrees that you have. So how have you. these degrees that you've had you know, helped you to, you know, to work with you know, your new career now as a producer? Mm. Well, the mechanical engineering part, you know, it deals with a lot of um, mathematics and all. Then music production also. Music is mathematics, if you look at it. Mm. Yeah. The sounds is calculated in decibel, if you don't know, dB. So dB is also in physics, which I did, normal, further mathematics, mechanical engineering. So, you know, it's, it's just so easy with the knobs and everything. Like, it's just like, I've seen this before. I've seen it in my class. So let me imprint it on mm. the machines, yeah. That's, that's good. I'm telling you. That's lovely. So now we know music is also this little bit of math Mathematics, in music. yes. We learn every day. I just learned one today. Mm -hmm. All right, let's talk about award and recognition. You know, you know, you won best, uh, what they call music, music producer, producer of the yes. year. You of know, um, and this happened in 2018. Mm -hmm. So how has this, you know, recognition helped your career? Uh, well, uh, the recognition, I was given the award at uh, Ikorodu, uh, from the event in Ikorodu. So, uh, I'm actually based in Ikorodu, so okay. I would say currently, when you're talking about producer, music producer in Ikorodu, you mentioned Chabalayaga. Mm. Yes, before you mention anybody. I don't know anybody, but yeah. you mentioned Chabalayaga. My dear, if you don't know, praise yourself, who go praise you? Now, me go praise myself. Ah. Oh, wow, I show what kids now. What is clear? I say clear. You wrote clear. Thank you. Mm. So how, how did that help your career? So mm. We call it a recognition. Mm -hmm. I'm so recognized everywhere, everywhere like, now. oh, this is the guy, not the guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. So, what's your future great. plan? You know, something that you, you know, looking forward to the future. What do you, you know, think of doing in the future when it comes to, you know, being a music producer? And do you look forward to, like, you know, having more artists in, you know, in your space and producing more songs for them? Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I look forward to becoming a big music mogul, like the likes of then Jimmy Dupree, then Snoop Dogg. So at this moment, I'm not even anywhere. I've not even started. I'm still like, still scratching up. So um, there's a whole lot of things I want to do in the music industry. And I hope God gives me hey, the... Mention one thing. <laughs> You can you can just say your see you're talking about recognition, you're talking about networking. Yeah, so say yeah, one thing. Okay, I say one thing. <laughs> say I, yourself now. One I, one second. Go. <laughs> <laughs> and I just fucked up. Ah no, you no, you didn't. All right, no problem. So thank you so much. All, right. All right, so where can we find you on you know, your different social media handle okay. if you're looking for a yeah, producer? I'm on, I am on Instagram at uh, slowmo underscore chabalayaga. That's S L O M O underscore C H A B A L A Y A G A. Okay. Slow mode underscore Chabalayaga. On Twitter, it's at I am underscore slow mode. The slow mode is S L O W then mode. Oh, okay. And um, Facebook, my name, Alofi Fedayo. All right. Facebook. So I'm gonna, I'm just going to ask you one question before I let you go. Right. Yeah, I'm enjoying myself with you. I'm like. enjoying myself with you. Too, <laughs> so right. let's talk about uh, the use of drug in the music industry, right? You know, there are a lot of things where people say that, oh, you know you have to get to a certain level you know for you to write good songs for you to be a good producer so tell oh. me about that oh, that's a very big lie mm. don't do drugs i'll tell you don't do drugs please don't do drugs i say it again don't mm. do drugs drugs have um spoiled a lot of people's life a lot of notable people where we know don't spoil their life so please don't do drugs drug will just make you look like a vegetable at the end of the day Fine, you might feel like you are enhanced, there is um, some kind of thing in your head, but I won't lie to you, it's just flims. Like, just 
Okay. It's just a mirage. Just a mirage. Yeah. I think I'll go with that. It's just a mirage. It's just a mirage. Say no to drugs. Say no to drugs. Say no to Don't drugs. do drugs, please. <laughs> uh, this is coming from Shaba. Chaba Layaga. Chaba Layaga. Just call me Chaba. Oh, Chaba. Chaba. Yeah, Chaba. 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 I think I like that. Yeah, just call Chaba. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Chaba. Thank you very much. For coming over. I, I had so much it. fun with you. Thank All you. right. Um, when we come back from this break, we'll have our next guest. And, you know, it's going to be filled with just asking like different questions about the music journey and how this guest, you know, is trying to make wave in the music industry in Nigeria. So don't go anywhere. This is Silverbed today. I'll see you soon. <laughs>